Hello, Xavier here. Welcome back to another video on my channel. And today we're going to be playing a modded Terraria adventure with Silver. Say hello, my friend. Yo. Alright, so we're going to start by setting up our stuff. So we're going to be mainly just standing here. <laughs> so, first things first, let's. I'm going to start making the, uh, the, the class bag. And I, I want to go with the. Okay. So, oh God, oh getting God. rid of death, for sure. Yeah, getting rid of death. That's the one thing I'm getting rid of. Definitely. Okay, so I got my forceful thing right here. You you, you are you see the bar, uh, the the rage bar and the adrenaline bar on your left, right on the top left. Yes. Okay, you can get rid of the anti buff and as well as the void heart. All right, you can see that it's not. Yeah, yeah, I can like see. the anti buff thing's not on, right? Yeah, you're good. Yeah, we should be fine. Okay, okay, so I'm getting rid of the anti buff and the thing. Okay, cool. So I got rid of the anti buff and the heart as well. <laughs> so there, that's good. Now, I chose the you. You already know. I already chose the the. Uh, Physical class. I'm gonna be physical, and then I'll, I'll, I'll probably dab into dabble into some. Uh, the warrior, archery. right? Yeah, I'm a warrior. I'm a I'm the warrior, so I'm gonna have more health and defense than you do. Um, woo! All right, you have more mana. You probably have like two or three mana stars, right? Okay, so I guess I have two right now. You have two? All right, cool. I have two as well. Um, I'm actually gonna start by mining this ore right here. Uh, getting this ore up. Go. I leveled okay, up. Awesome. Whatever's making the water noise is annoying the crap out of me. It's on the right. Oh, it's your friend over there. What's the thing that's going in and out of water? It's your friend in the bottom right here. The guy that you is like. Johnny Atmore? Yeah, he's in the bottom there. The bottom. He's right under you too. I can see. Oh, he's, he's below us. Yeah, he's right under you. Yeah. They usually have the map turned off. Yeah. Okay. Bombs away. Oh god. I'm not gonna build anything too complicated, because I mean. Why should we at the beginning of the game? But let me build this up a little bit like this because we do have two NPCs. So uh, let's let's start chopping down some more trees. I'm guessing you're gonna go mining for a little bit, or oh no, you're trying to get to to your boy. Okay, he's he's gonna go and save his yeah, friend. Yeah, I'm gonna get my boy. Yeah, uh, yeah. I'm about to make two houses. That way we can put both of them inside. I think that'll be helpful. Yeah, I can see him. The he... light is touching his face. <laughs> he's be he's saved. There's levels. Yeah, there's there's levels. Like, yeah. I dropped down a little bit and it told me it was a desert level ten. Yeah, I know. So basically, the levels mod it actually suggests you to be level ten before you actually head into the desert. So that's basically what it's saying. It's it's pretty helpful, um, and it'll be even more helpful for like other places as well. Why? Why? We were doing so well without a fairy, and all of a sudden, okay. Thank, oh, thank God, the guide is so strong. <laughs> mm -hmm. That put that, that put that beautiful music on. We're almost to nighttime. Oh my God, we succeeded in but, building so a house. Now we should be able to. Yeah, I was gonna say we should be able to. Assign. Yeah, we should be able to assign for both oh, of them. Later that. There we go. There we go. Um, awesome. Okay. Cool. Oh. Uh. 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 uh, uh, uh how are you saved it. <laughs> okay. Cool. So uh, I should make some planks so we can actually organize our chest a bit more. Uh. Yeah. Put them up here. Oh, no, nope. up here. There we go. Take that down. And there we have it. Our first two Hello, chests. Barry. There we go. Whew. Okay, so the first start of the game. Not that bad, not that great either. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so. Uh, I'm going to go down to this yeah. guy. 
Howie. I'm going to sell my iron sword to you, and I'm also gonna Weird. my copper sword. I'm gonna keep uh, this. Oh, I'm this. immediately level four now. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I should probably start killing stuff as well. Oh, talking okay. about ki talking about killing. <laughs> uh, I need to level up. I I think I'm only level two, so I should probably level up too. Kill the zombie. Kill the zombie. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm kill the damn zombie! Okay, so our first boss we should technically fight is the Glade Wraith. Spawn in for destroy bone, al bo uh, bone altar in the underground briar. The Glade Wraith also spawns naturally at nighttime after defeating the Eye of Cthulhu. How is that the first boss? Okay, King Slime is definitely the first boss we're gonna be taking down. Uh, let's see what the crafting is for the, uh, the, 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 the old leather, I think. Oh, I can do some really cool stuff. Ooh, this is some good uh, melee damage there. Good, good, good vicious. Uh, uh, he's max life by 10. Hell yeah. I need some iron bars now. Woo! Okay, these leathers are going to be very helpful for like our main uh, stuff for this, the beginning of the game. So, definitely going to want to get some leather. A, uh, okay, so I need to upgrade my enhancement. Because yeah. that's summon damage. Yeah, summon damage, and then there's also one for mana. I think that's intelligence, okay. right? Oh, <laughs> yo! Yeah, I think that's intelligence. Oh! This damn thing. That was not cool. That was not cool. It went right after me after that, too. We're just. Alright. We're just. I two applied two levels to my enhancement. Okay, hello drone. You're back from war, I see. Oh god. What was that? What's this circle I see over here? How do, how do we freaking... Ooh, stone stuff? What? You can make stone armor? That is amazing. Gives you armor, some really good stuff too, like what? Damn, that's awesome. Look at that. Ooh, I need some more cobblestone. I'm gonna go get some more stone. <laughs> I think that's the best armor we can get for now is the stone one, so I, I suggest I, I suggest uh, for now just get the stone. Yeah, I'm being chased by two demon eyes and a zombie. Those things are strong, bro. Like, oh my god. Damn thing. Oh my god. Oh, they flew over me good. The zombie. Now I can pick up this mana star. Zambi. <laughs> Behind you! I see it now. There you go, you killed it. Oh my I'm god. You have so much experience. <laughs> they only need 12 more experience. Yeah, at first it shows you how much experience you got, and then it shows you the next amount that you need to get a level up. So as you can see, oh my god, I didn't even notice that thing in there. But yeah, look how fast I fall. You see. Where's my iron though? Oh, there it is. <laughs> uh, it's a great start to the series, guys. Great start to the series. Yeah, super great. I can make some. We can make gelatin armor, bro. Gelatin armor? Yeah. What the heck? Oh shoot! I did not mean to do that. Here, I'll give you the one piece I made. By accident, I made it by accident, but I'm gonna go to you. It, interesting. The I I had a I, I didn't have a lot of slime, so I, I was only able to make one piece. But let me uh, give you the uh, the piece of armor that I made. Like, oh, cool! We found a tree. That's awesome. Do we get experience for traveling on the map? Uh, I think we do. I'm not sure. Maybe it has to do with stamina. Oh, maybe. Yeah. We got a slime. It's uh, 109. Purple one. Yeah. We got this. We're a party. <laughs> All right. I got three experience for that. You got uh, six. There's another one behind us. Okay. Oh, instantly. <laughs> oh, what's up? Oh, I hate this shit. Oh, okay, there we go. <laughs> I did one hit. Yeah. Anything down there? 
not anything of value. Okay. But now I can't get it. <laughs> I got you. Oh, there's another one. Ah, oh, shit. No way. Oh, he boosted me up, Al. Ah, oh, shit. I killed it the moment it killed me. Oh my god, what the heck? <laughs> That's crazy, damn. Okay, so we're gonna have to go back there and, and see if we can uh, get ourselves uh, situated there. Uh, but first things first, let's uh, see what else I can do here. There's some really cool throwable weapons I can make as well. Bloody arrows has a chance of briefly skewering hit foes. Damn, oh that's awesome. That's killer. And we can also make the living lo loom immediately, which is really cool. Uh, let me make some more of these, though. Some more iron bars. We got a ferry to the right, my friends. Alright. Yeah, I see it. If I can take its weapon... That'd be great, huh? Yeah. Hit and drop it, though. Slightly increased weapon speed, slightly increased movement speed and acceleration. Uh, the Francisca. Yeah, rusted pipes. What else can I make? I can make a piping. Interesting. Critical 14. I can do a total of 11. 11 base? Yeah, 10. 8 space. And then 14, 13. Ooh, that does do a lot too. 6 combo power cost. Directly consumes combo for an empowered strike. Combo grants 4 bonus damage. Uh, right click consumes. I really want to make that though, that's a question. I think I can make something better with it, I just gotta see what else I can make. Let's see, what can I make? The sluggy. There's the ranged weapon and there's this thing, so. Minions have a small chance to return. Oh yeah, there's this really cool thing you can do. Uh, ooh, what is that? The Dream Shred Essence, that might be really... This is a really cool thing called the Cloak of Healing. It says minions have a small chance to return life. So, just thought I'd throw that out there. <laughs> Marksman, the uh, Leather Safeguard. I need five iron bars. Oh, I need more iron. More. We must mine more. Got a new hidden ability? Uh, so oh no, I don't want to die yet. Come on, I, I'm in a good position right now. You can slap you out of nowhere. Uh, scan, I'll just see non player levels also shows health bars below its teaser when it. Fuck yeah. <coughs> what is it? Disease slime. Oh my god, level 9? They all have levels? I did not know that. No wonder some of them are stronger than someone. <laughs> so I, I, actually, I can actually see their levels and stuff now. Which is really helpful. You should probably heal too, I'm not gonna lie. It even tells you their strength and their resistance. God damn it. <laughs> the life regeneration at the beginning of the game sucks so badly, bro. Yeah. Alright, I am beak. Oh, nice, you made a house. Yeah. Uh, Give me right. for that little piece of wall above the air. Yeah. Above the ceiling. <laughs> huh. I wonder how much gems will. Oh, give uh, me experience? Yeah, because yeah. yeah, they're kind of rare. Kind of. Yeah, kind of. Topaz isn't very rare. Ooh, or did amethyst. I, did I find a nice blue area? Oh my goodness. I got 66 experience. Okay, my friend, so I found two hearts, which is really cool. I'll give one to you as well. Oh, I'm about to find out what I what happens when you get emeralds. Let me see. Oh. Ooh. That was a good amount. 30? 30 from one emerald? Yeah. Nice. That's actually really good. Huh? I kind of hope that the, uh, uh, what was it now? The Curio Trader shows up. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's the Toho guy. Uh, okay. Yeah. It's like one of the confirmed male characters. 
<laughs> one of the very, very few. <laughs> you can tell when the sanity goes up when uh, the screen starts getting weird. What do you mean it gets weird? Like you start seeing circles around. Like they are Oh, you mean when it goes down? Like, yeah, it gets darker, I guess you could say. Like when it goes down, you mean? Because yeah. when it goes up, it's fine. Yeah, when it goes down, man. Huh. What the hell is that? So what's the what does the old leather do? Uh, well, you you're able to craft some stuff with it, which is good. Uh, I'm actually gonna try to craft a shield with it, which increases my health by ten. <laughs> which is good. I mean, yeah, I, I recommend you get the shield as well. Some r rubies give you twenty four, which is really cool. Cool. Hell yeah, that's it. I got a, a really cool pickaxe just now. Mm. It, it was just a thing. It, it, it's called the... What's it called? The freaking... Wow. It's pretty big. It's called the Brilliant Harvester. My, my screen is shaking. What the hell? <laughs> what the actual hell? My screen is shaking. Like badly, bro. <laughs> it started sh like like vibrating shake. Yeah, it's because my sanity is about to hit zero, bro. I just uh, made fourteen iron bars. Okay, you said you made fourteen. Yeah, I made fourteen. Nice. So let me see. Let me show you what my spoils are that I've gathered. I have a total of 31 iron bars and 38 copper bars, which is really a, a big upgrade, pretty much. Um, I'm going to go make my uh, leather safeguard, which is going to be really cool. And it's armored. I got a really good roll on it, too. Here's your um, your heart. Oh, thank you. I got you, man. I got you. <laughs> Don't worry. I got six rubies, which is really cool. I hate the fact that this armor really does, uh, earth. What? Oh, yeah, I can make you the, uh, chest plate now. Here you go. Oh, for the gel thing? Yeah, give me some more gel. You got more gel? I got eight more. Okay, give it to me. I think I can get you the boots now. Here you go. That's a full set. Uh, what's the, uh, the set effect? Increased. Jump height negates 75% of all fall damage. Nice. You bounce when you land. Oh, do you? I want to see that. Okay, hold on. See, like me, this is what happens when I jump. I just go down really quickly. What if you fall from a high height? From oh, yeah, I was going to say. Oh, wait. I saw you bounce a little bit, yeah. It's just, yeah, it's just small jump stuff. You take one damage, I do too. <laughs> Alright. I still don't like the fact that I go down so quickly like that, though. Yeah. Okay, anyways. That worked out pretty good. That run was really good. Uh, I got some more chests on me, though, so... I should probably lay those down, because... And... Well, put one in the other house, so... I'll just, I'll just start putting this chest around because, like, <laughs> that's so much stuff. Oh, you have a golden chest. Hell yeah, I do. Do you want the, uh, the Hermes boots? Um, nah, good. Alright, brother. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait, wait, Hermes boots? Yeah. Hermes boots? I'm sorry, yeah. I wasn't thinking straight. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, take them. There we go, Hermes boots. <laughs> Okay, so what can I make with Ruby? I know there was something I can make with Ruby that could be helpful for me. Uh, what was it? Was this a good Ruby monster? ring? Uh, you can make life crystals with Ru- Oh! You can make life crystals, what? bro. You just need pink gel, five bones, one healing potion, and one Ruby, and you can make life crystals. What? That's actually really cool. Uh, what is this? Wall rod, prismatic spray, gemstone blaster, ruby ring. Uh, you melee weapons, flickers with heat. 
I don't know what that means, but I should probably make it. <laughs> okay, I don't know what it does, but... Oh, does it give me the fire effect? Okay, cool. So I guess that's what it does. Uh, whip ball. That's a rogue weapon. What else can I think with a ruby? I have three more rubies. A large ring for capture the gem. Okay. Um, so I can make the sword of red wall, which is something I would love to make, but I need meteorite for that. And how about the geo? A glimmering and multiple. What? You can make a band of regeneration, bro. What you, the? You, you can actually craft one. So you need one life crystal, twelve iron bars, and one ruby. Oh my god, this, ugh, this is the best mod mod uh, mods ever, like, bro. <laughs> okay, so um, do you want to shield as well? The uh, the leather safeguard it increases your armor by one, as well as gives you ten extra health. Uh. Oh, come on. Stupid drone. <laughs> oh, wait, do you you have more old leather, though, right? What? You have more nether, though, right? More what? Old leather. Oh, uh, I have five. Okay. Will that work, or...? Yeah, give it to me, and then I can make you one of the shields. That way, you get at ten extra health. All right. So where's that? Here you go. <coughs> that increases your uh, your health by ten more, which is going to be really helpful. And it gives you defense. What, what kind of uh, applications? Oh, hey! Okay. I finally hit a hundred health. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Anyway, you were saying? Oh no, you you good. <laughs> I was just like, I'm trying to figure out what would be the like the best things to craft, or what what should I craft next and stuff like that. Uh, pistols. I can make pistols with <laughs> what? Stone sling bullet. There's so many things you can make in this now. It's incredible. Just looking at everything, it's like, okay, cool. Uh, do you want a, uh, a, a hook? Here you go. I'm, I'm gonna make you one anyways. A hook? Yes. Here you please. go. Oh, uh, yeah. Scrap weed. It's very slow, but hey. It's a hook. Oh, I see. Oh, there's also, like, no range. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's a hook. <laughs> That's what matters. <laughs> Alright, so, let's see. Ah, man, I have so much stuff in my inventory, it's crazy. I guess, uh, we could leave the first episode here. And then, yeah. off screen, we can, like, get some more materials. And also, just, like, level out the area in this area. Because, like, right now, it's all crazy. <laughs> Alright, yeah. th guys, thank you guys for watching this first episode of the Monte Terraria playthrough. Um... I'm very excited about the playthrough, not gonna lie. Uh, there's a lot of stuff we need to research and a lot of stuff uh, we need to do. Uh, you see that? That right there, my friends, is the great definition of what this uh, mod pack has in store for us. <laughs> Alright, well, I will see you guys next time, right, Silver? Yeah, see you later. Alright, see ya.